In this video, let's examine what makes a video be recommended. You see here on the right side is a full list of videos that are recommended. Okay. And okay, let's take a look and see. First of all, they have a next video. We don't care about the next video in this particular video because we're, we just care about the recommended list. Now, we have a, a video by the same creator on a very similar topic and that makes sense. Also another business video, another business video, and then boom, Evander Holyfield. Okay, that does not make sense. So this is a boxing video, and I've been watching some boxing videos. You can see here, Comedians and Cars. It's a comedy video. It's something that I like. So YouTube puts a combination of videos that are made by the same creator and are relevant <clears throat> and things that you as the viewer might like. So whatever the viewer might like, you have little control over that. But you have more control over things that, uh, that you as the creator have made on the same topic. And that's what is going to be recommended. And some creators, they're able to have a lot of videos that are related. And so YouTube recommends them together. You can see here, this is by Evan Carmichael, and here's another video by Evan Carmichael, and then if we scroll down, here's another video by Evan Carmichael, and let's see if we scroll down if there's any more. So there's a lot of UFC stuff, and this is something that I've been watching. Uh, and then also this Stanford Business School thing is, it looked like a video that I was watching before, but actually it's not, so never mind that. And so there's two videos here by Evan Carmichael. I've seen some creators have almost all the videos be populated with their own videos, but that only happens when the videos are really, really related to each other and the videos get a lot of views. You can see here there's a similarity in how it's related. The title is almost the same. It's about Steve Jobs things and the video views, this one has 700,000 views and this one has 3 million views. So they have quite a few bit of views. And you can see that other YouTube videos that YouTube recommends are by this Brian Tracy. Brian is a very popular, obviously a business guru, and he's got also a really large number of views. So it's videos that also are, that are related that are not by this creator have about in the proximity of similar numbers of views. So that tells you that you need to have more videos that are related that are about the same number of views. And the interesting, the kicker here is, the really interesting things is that, remember that all the whole time in this course, I'm talking about the snowball effect, the snowball effect. This is the ideal example of the snowball effect because when your video, let's say your video gets to 100,000 views or 200,000 or a million views, then it gets recommended on these videos that are also have these insane amounts of views. And so every day, those videos have a lot of people watching them, and your video is right on the right side of them. So your video gets fed all these viewers from the very popular videos on YouTube, and this, this is the way that you get, if you push your video enough, with all the metrics, engagement, likes, all that stuff, and if you push the views enough, you'll get to a stratosphere within YouTube where they start recommending you next to really popular videos and you get a flood of extra views. So your goal is really to get so big that instead of your search you being your number one driver of traffic, you should get to a point where your number one driver of traffic is actually recommended views. That's how you tell that snowball effect of YouTube has really kicked in. And the more you balloon in there, the more you'll have recommended vi videos, recommended section, promote your video. But to get there, again, it's number of views and relevance. And especially if you have your own videos, then you'll promote your own next to your own, which is better because then you don't lose viewers by having them click on other people's recommended, vi video, vi recommended videos. You can keep viewers by having them click your other recommended videos that are yours so you can get people watching more than one video of yours.